for the fucking food all the time, you know? And he was high as fuck. He's like, you want 30 a fucking hits trip of tonight, acid? Man? And I was like, eh, I was off for the next day or two, so I was like, sure, man. He's like, open your mouth. What? And stupidly I did, and he had an eyedropper, and he squirted a bunch of fucking acid in my mouth. Like, I could feel it. <laughs> and you're not supposed to. I could feel the shit running down the back of my throat. And I was like, dude, what the fuck? He's like, oh man, you're gonna be high. That was like 20 or 30 hits of acid, man. <laughs> so, I knew I was in trouble. So, my goal was to get back to my house as soon as possible before the shit kicked in, right? Because I, I didn't know what to expect on that many hits. I'd never taken more than like three or four at a time. And three and four, you're pretty high. Oh, well, yeah. I got on the fucking bus, and it kicked in. You know, usually it takes like an hour to kick in and shit. No, this kicked in like 20 minutes. So, I'm kind of fucked. And you know how like when you're on yeah, acid, like, you know, shit kind of breeze, you know, the colors are brighter, you know, you see tracers and shit, uh-uh, not on 20 or 30 hits you don't, you lose your fucking mind, man, like, like, I almost went blind, I was, I was hallucinating so hard, I was seeing just shit like melt before my eyes, I couldn't read, uh, my, oh, my no, you can't. frame of vision was like constantly like, like that, I was like, what the fuck, and I missed my bus stop because I was high as fuck. I got off at the wrong bus, or the wrong bus stop, and I was only like maybe a mile away from my house, right? But I was so high I couldn't even fucking walk straight, man. I ended up sitting next to the canal, talking to myself, until the sun came up. And I peaked for like five or six hours, man. Not like one or two hours, like with a couple hits. I peaked like at least five or six hours. I lost all concept of reality and time. It was quite spiritual, and I wasn't really scared, though, because I knew it was just the drug, so... I was more worried that I couldn't find my way home, and I, it took me like eight hours to, like, which should have taken me like 20 minutes, but I made it. I made it. And I was high for like two days. It kind of sucked. I started to get worried after a while because I was like, am I ever going to not be high again? <laughs> and uh, so, yeah, that was my experience. I don't recommend taking that much LSD. Uh, <laughs> it's probably unhealthy. Uh, I don't think I've been right ever since. I got like a tick now. That's crazy, bro.